Hi there, my name is Matt Cole. And I'm Brian Garrity. And we are the producers of this Experts Podcast, and we are here with Andy Poindexter. What's up, guys? Hey, how's it going, Andy? Pretty well. Uh, Andy, if you don't know, is a very MVP, I guess that the MVP at the Bush Comedy Theater. The only one. <laughs> the only one, in fact. Uh, he is a uh, world-renowned accompanist for um, the Double Treble, as well as the accompanist for all the musical improv stuff. Uh, I saw you do some other improv the other night, some non-music stuff. What did I see you in? Uh, Tales uh, from the Campfire? Yeah, I was, uh, I, I've done Tales from the Campfire mm -hmm. um, back in the spring. And um, yeah. I also jumped in with uh, Skeleton Crew for their, uh, <laughs> That's what it was. their yeah. glorious <laughs> Christmas special. And I missed that. What, what did you do dur during that? Um, uh, on a couple of occasions, yeah. I just kind of did some background music. Yeah. And then in a couple others, I, I did a music improv scene with Ed and Standy. And, uh, he got in a pile up for a uh, family reunion Christmas edition. <laughs> but I do think the, the crowning achievement was um, was Angel Sanchez doing his uh, Kwanzaa rap. <laughs> well, it was more of a Kwanzaa, uh, like neo soul kind of thing. Yeah. But he just straight up improvised a song about Kwanzaa to everybody. Yeah, maybe I've never, it was the first time I ever cried over Kwanzaa. <laughs> I was crying for other reasons. <laughs> that is so great. Uh, yeah, and um, actually, you know so much about music. We actually, we talked about this. I don't think you were there. We talked about, because I actually had, and I have a Bob Dylan poster right behind him. me right there. He's peeking and at we me. had a big conversation. I don't even remember. I think we were both drinking that night. But um, I talked about his vocal technique, and you said the glissando that he uses. Like, hey, hey, I'm Bob Dylan, you know, that sort of thing. Well, it's funny you bring that up. Yeah. I actually, after that conversation, because yeah. I was telling you that it, it kind of came from... Mm -hmm. um, what did I tell you? Uh, not like blue Scotch Irish, <laughs> Scotch bluegrass. Yeah, bluegrass. Welcome yeah. to recreating right. drunk conversations, <laughs> recreating drunk conversations. <laughs> with the sex hurts. <laughs> but to expand on that, yeah. I, I did some thinking and some reading, and yeah. um, honestly, gypsy music. <gasps> yeah, this gets further and further, and it I'm does. actually because it, it really weird things like that rack my brain. I'm glad we should talk more about that. Yeah, man. Um, my mom used to threaten to sell me to the gypsies. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what else are you involved in? Non comedy, comedy. What else? I mean, nowadays, yeah. I'm living out here, I just mm -hmm. teach. Yeah. And, um, <laughs> I know, just teach. Yeah. On day in day out, making bread. Honestly, it's a it's a lot less crazy than yeah. when I lived in Lynchburg because yeah. there was maybe five cats out there who played yeah. jazz, piano improvise you know any any sort of thing like that yeah. and we were always working so yeah. it was a very exhausting <laughs> i had like seven bands at one point <laughs> you know mostly contract bands like yeah. so you got to pack up and drive yeah. to god knows where wow so so do you do any of that now or i uh, know i <laughs> do you miss you don't miss that i don't miss it you know like yeah. the first week i moved to virginia beach it was yeah. pouring down rain and i was walking in town center and yeah. i saw this this band loading into uh uh, whatever that uh, Kelly's down yeah. there, mm -hmm. and you know, it's just I don't miss that. You, know? <laughs> you look down on them shame like you poor souls. Dude, I, yeah, I know how y'all feel. <laughs> so, uh, what were some of the band names, by the way? Are they cool bands. Uh, my uh, favorite one was the one that I came up with for my jazz combo yeah. was Swing Theory because you know it was like <laughs> String Theory. Yeah, yeah, I thought it was cute. No one else got it. You know? <laughs> That's Lynchburg, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, oh, yeah. Swing theory. What in hell bales is what? science? <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, did you come up with Double Trouble, by the way? I did not. I think oh. it, was, it was either Kate or Alba. It was a yeah. cute name. And then, <laughs> it was. then they said um, they said when uh, we had a third person, they can call yeah. it Triple Fret. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Wait, there is three people, though. It's you and them two. Well, uh, we're, they're not counting. <laughs> no. Musicians have never been famous for math skills. so. <laughs> but string theory, yes. <laughs> uh, I like swing theory. Oh, God. Um, cool. Actually, talk to us about Double Trouble. How's that going? And wh it's, what does the future hold for you guys? Well, it's fun. We're mm -hmm. always evolving the show. Mm -hmm. You know, we started off trying to do a, a two person, almost like musical herald sort yeah. of form. Like it had beats to it, openings, closings. And uh, as we've progressed through what mm -hmm. we're doing, um, you know, Kate's been coming up with all these fantastic mm -hmm. ideas for games and, you know, recurring segments that mm -hmm. they keep bringing back. So. Uh, we're just we're looking for any kind of ways to just spice things up yeah. every single month and make it great. Yeah, actually, uh, um, I don't think I saw your last show, but you guys have been involved. I've been seeing that. It's like you bring like new interesting things, not like like reinventing the wheel sort of thing, not but like really. each time I'm like, yeah, they're like really kind of like falling into their groove, you mm -hmm. know, in order to use some um, technical lingo. What are you doing there, Brian? You're distracted. How's your phone? 
<laughs> I'm coordinating our future guests. <laughs> I'm running a goddamn podcast here while you're just talking shit. All right, we'll let Brian get back. He's, he's ornery. I am angry. <laughs> um, all right. Well, uh, it's we're we're glad that you're finally on the show. Yeah, man. Me too. Thanks. And uh, anything else coming up? You want to plug or um, when is your next double trouble show? As a matter of fact, tomorrow yeah. night with the pushies. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Pushies. I'm, I'm, <laughs> oh, I'm technically filling in for the great uh, Terry O'Quinn. You know, he's uh, he <laughs> Wait, was, he's not he, going to make it. He was going to be the uh, <laughs> accompanist for double trouble tomorrow night, and now it, or. I guess this will air someday. Yeah. So anyways, yeah, right. he was going to do the accompaniment, and then I think he yeah. uh, decided he wanted to do some family time. So. Yeah, I probably would, too, if I was Terry Quinn. Yeah. <laughs> He's a busy man. Uh, so I guess then your next show would be, so Pushies, and then... You know, I don't have the date in front yeah. of me, but it's always the third Saturday of the third month. Third Saturday, okay, so yeah. That's what I was going to say second, third. Third Saturday of the month at 8 p.m., 8 correct? 8 p.m. Cool. All right, yeah. well, we can't wait to see you. Are you in an improv class right now? I'm not. I've been waiting and waiting for yeah. 501 to start, which will be when the new space opens. So, oh, that's oh, exciting. class with Andy. Uh, yeah. Class with Andy. <laughs> I'm excited for 501. Me too. All right. Uh, any <laughs> welcome back, Brian. Any last words? Uh, no, I'm good. <laughs> okay. um, next time you guys get drunk and talk about Bob Dylan, <laughs> uh, feel free to continue to exclude me. <laughs> We'll FaceTime you. I, I, saw, I saw Dylan live with G.E. Smith at the Center. All right, that's nice. all the time we have. <laughs> all right, thanks, Andy. Bye-bye. Thanks.